some of the things that have been on my mind lately are um, making Antarctica a country and making Antarctica, making um, the UN the governing council. Um, A shower. It's nice in a shower sometimes. I have great thoughts. Um, some other things that are on my mind. I mean, I could go into that or like go on to the other things that I've been thinking about. It's like I have like these these over these things. A space elevator. We got to build a space elevator and start researching the carbon fiber uh, that we will cut to produce thinner carbon fiber that we can stack next to itself to make stronger fiber cables up to a space station and then run a magnetic elevator up and down and then we could build several elevators of course at one station build hundreds of them um, but I'm thinking like just get one at least one cable up to a station and that's the step um, also I've been thinking about putting magnets in orbit and using them to move the clouds around, but it would it wouldn't be like do 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 like a video game. It'd be like you put them into orbit like um, in, in a in a pattern where they're always going to be something over a certain spot if you want it to, and then they can you can slow them down or speed them up, and they just kind of as they pass over that area they hold the cloud there and then they keep going and then the next one comes and maybe moves it or something. And, you could move clouds to dry areas and populate them, I guess, give them water. Um, I mean, I could tell you my reasoning for all those. Those are just like three. I think the Antarctica one, I just had this idea, was like on the par with the other two. But the space elevator is like... It's, I mean, think of it. Everything we put into space, we could build in space. So I guess the only really problem is how do you generate the electricity to power the magnets, the electromagnets? And you could use solar energy. I mean, you might get more solar energy from a space station than from a ground unit. Or wind turbines and shit. Dude, build solar updraft towers around them. They look cool. They look phallic. They just stick up. But they're like, you put tarp them and they collect heat under at, at ground level and they rush through these turbines at the base of the tower into this air, huge air tower. And just hot air goes up out the tower. It's just constant heat during the day in the desert. So, like, in Mexico, and then it would be a great United States project in Mexico. We could pour all this money into it, create all these interspace relations between the two countries. It would be, like, a new level for United States and Mexico to kind of come together on. would be, like, outer space. I mean, it seems like it's almost so too, so obvious that I shouldn't talk about it, but I should at least I guess, make, some, make a video of it. I don't know, document it. The ideas, document the ideas. So I guess that's why I'm going on about it right now. Anyway, I guess that means I've, I've talked enough about it. Electromagnetic clouds, I mean, that's just a fun etch-a-sketch. Let me know what you think about these things. Okay. So.